Hello, I'm Zach from Etherboost. If you haven't heard of us, we make decentralized trading applications. For example, EtherDelta, the decentralized token exchange, Etheropt, the decentralized options exchange, and Prediction Token, which mints prediction market tokens. These three products are all live right now, and Ethereum Dollar, the stable dollar token, is coming soon. What I want to talk about today is how to use EtherDelta with MetaMask. So here's MetaMask, the Chrome plugin that lets you use Ethereum from your browser. I will go and install it. I want to add to Chrome. And you can see MetaMask has been installed. I'm going to go ahead and use it for the first time. I have to agree to these terms of service and I will create a new vault. I need a password for the vault. And now I'm going to switch from the test network to the main Ethereum network. I'll type my password in again. Now I have to agree to this warning. And here I am looking at my first MetaMask wallet. And I'm going to press this buy button. This will let me use Coinbase to buy some Ether. So I'm going to type in my email address. Now because I already signed in to Coinbase, I just need to type in my phone verification code. And now I need to type in the credit card I'm going to use for this purchase. And finally, I agree to this price. Now if I open MetaMask again, I can click this button to open up Etherscan. And now I can see I have a pending transaction for the 0.45 Ether. It's now confirmed. And if I open up MetaMask again, I can see I now have a balance of 0.45 Ether in my account. So now I'm going to go to Ether Delta. And the first thing I'll need to do is go to the address dropdown, which is in the upper right of EtherDelta, and my MetaMask account will be loaded in here. I just need to select it. There it is. Now here you can see the different tokens I can trade. Right now I'm looking at the Maker order book. I'll switch to the Trump Y order book. This is one of the prediction tokens that I mentioned earlier. Now I'm going to go back to the maker order book because I want to do a maker trade today. So the first thing I need to do is look up at my balance. This is the balance in my Ethereum wallet. And in order to make a trade with that balance, I need to actually deposit some of it to EtherDelta. Remember EtherDelta is a decentralized exchange. So the funds are not held by any central authority. They are in fact in your control in the Ether Delta smart contract. And in order to get them into the smart contract, first I need to deposit them. So if I scroll down to this balances section, I can see my Ether balance in my wallet and my Ether Delta balance, which is zero. So I'm going to go ahead and deposit some of my Ether into Ether Delta. Now I need to approve this first transaction. This one gives EtherDelta the right to do a transfer on my behalf. And then one more transaction to actually do the deposit. Now I'm getting an error that there was not enough gas in my account. And that's because I need to have a little bit of Ether left over in my account to pay the gas fee to the Ethereum network. So I'll go to deposit 0.25 instead. Press deposit again, approve the transaction, okay, 
Now under my transactions, I have a pending transaction. And what I can do is actually click the little box next to those three question marks. And I can see that this transaction was confirmed 18 seconds ago. I'll go back to Ether Delta, and now I see that my deposit actually shows up here. And there's my Ether Delta balance now in Ether. Back to the top of the page, I can see my account balance also shows up under this buy form. Now there are two ways to trade on Ether Delta. I can either fill out one of these forms to place an order in this order book, or if I see a trade that I like in the order book, I can press buy or sell and trade it right away using these buttons here. So I'll go ahead and place an order into the order book using the buy form. I want to buy Maker. I'll buy it for a price of 2.1. And I want to buy 0.1 Maker. And then I'm going to press buy. I need to approve this message signing transaction. This won't actually send a transaction to the blockchain, so it's not going to cost me any gas. It's simply going to sign my intent to trade and send it to the off-chain order book. So I will press approve. And now, in just a second, I should see my order appear in the order book. And it should be the top order because I want to buy at a price of 2.1. You can see my order is highlighted in light blue. I can now click it. And this will show me that it expires in 2,496 blocks. This is roughly half a day of Ethereum block time. And you can see I specified that when I placed the order. I can also cancel my order. This will actually send a transaction to the blockchain. So I'll press that now. And I need to approve this transaction. And as soon as that transaction is confirmed by the blockchain, my order should disappear from the order book. If I scroll down, I can see the pending transaction. And I can see it on Etherscan. Wait for it to confirm. It's confirmed now. And if I go back to Ether Delta, my order is now gone. Now let's say I want to do my trade right away. So I'm going to look at the order book. And I want to pick the order with the lowest price to buy, which is right here. So I'll go ahead and click that. And this buy order form pops up. And you can see there's a sell order that I'm trying to buy. 1.997 maker. Now I want to trade a part of this order, so I can specify the amount I want to trade here. So I can type in 0 0.01 and now press buy. And now I need to sign this transaction with MetaMask. And then if I go down the page, I can see my transaction is pending here. I'll open up Etherscan again. Now my transaction is confirmed. So I'll go back to Ether Delta. And now I should see my order has now been confirmed. It was a buy of 0.01 maker for a price of three maker per ether. Now if I scroll back up the page, I can see that my balance has been updated. And if I go back down, I can also see my balance down here. So there you go. You just did a trade with Ether Delta.